Residents all over our area have taken to several locations to show their patriotism, like doing a few fun things before the fireworks shows. Good evening, I'm Kim Chapman. And I'm Lauren St. Germain. News Channel 9's James Torres joins us now live from Saudi Lake to show us how people are celebrating this year's holiday. Hey, James. Yeah, Kim, Lauren, hundreds of people are here by the Saudi Lake gathered to see what everyone wants to see on the 4th of July day. Fireworks up in the sky, lighting them up. That's not going to come until later tonight, of course. But we did spend some time at different locations all afternoon to learn how people are preparing for this year's 4th of July celebrations. And believe me, there was plenty to do for everyone. You're going down. With a hot summer day in July, being in the water shouldn't be so bad. That's why several residents of Ray County came to the Shake the Lake event at the Spring City Lake this Independence Day. I have all kinds of food and I got the splash pad over across the lake and it's just a good place to be. A great place with tons to do. We had fundraisers, kids had America on their minds, and of course, who can forget all of the food? Yeah. Chocolate covered bacon. Chocolate covered bacon. Chocolate covered bacon. The very, very unique food. We even had a few pageants going on. Spoke to a three-year-old today who just won her 21st pageant. Here's what she had to say on her newest accolade. Fireworks. No fireworks just yet. That's going to come a little later. Right now, everyone is celebrating what they say means most to them about the birth of this nation. It's the, the guys in the service that made this free for us. Spending time with family, thinking about everything God's done for us. But for the kids, they mostly care for the fireworks. No matter what people love most about this holiday, they are gathered today for one important reason. Just remember the people who fought and died and have a good time and celebrate your freedom and do what you love to do. That's what America's all about. Now, coming up tonight at 6 o'clock, we'll tell you exactly what people here in Saudi are doing to prepare for their fireworks show. That's coming up later tonight at 9 o'clock. Reporting live from the Saudi Lake, James Torres, News Channel 9. All right, thanks, James. He had a really tough day today. And if you need a full list of fireworks shows going on around our viewing area tonight, head on over to our website, newschannel9.com.